I guess the Christmas memory that uh, probably stands head and shoulders above everything is the Christmas of 1997. Now at that time I hadn't yet moved over to the world of the Playstations, the Saturns, the Nintendo 64s. I was still very much happy with the Super Nintendo. Um, but I did want an N64, for mainly for Mario. I mean, why else would you want an N64? Mario has to be it, right? Um, so I wake up on Christmas morning, um, December 1997, and I go upstairs um, to, to the kitchen to, to make myself some breakfast. And sitting on the, on the kitchen table is this very small present with my name on it. Um, great, you know, I'm, I'm a teenager at the time, but I still love presents, of course. Um, what could it possibly be? So I hurriedly open up this, this very tiny little, little box um, to find a, a copy of GoldenEye 007. Um, which you know, great, I think. Okay, so I've got a, I've got a game, a Nintendo 64 game. But um, what is, where's the console to play it on? I've still got, I've only got a SNES. I haven't got anything to play it on. Um, and uh, I had another big box um, about half an hour later. As my parents woke up, they gave me this sort of big, massive box. I was like, well, maybe this is the Nintendo 64 console. And uh, I opened it up, and it was, um, it wasn't, it was a, it was a Yamaha. Um, keyboard stand because I played a lot of keyboard at the time um, and I was thoroughly confused I was like well hang on a second you've, you've bought me this um, this game for the Nintendo 64 and I haven't got a Nintendo 64 and they're like oh, oh sorry we we thought it worked for the Super Nintendo and of course my heart, my heart sunk it's uh, um, how, how can you not be disappointed in the situation um, which sounds quite ungrateful but yeah having a Nintendo 64 game without the console to play on is on Christmas Day is, is pretty bad um, so I sort of went back to my room and, and looked at the looked at the box, I opened it up and looked at the instruction manuals and everything. Um, and it came, I think it came to about another half hour later where um, my parents called me up. Um, and on that kitchen table again was a slightly bigger box wrapped up. And I opened it up and there it was, my, my Nintendo 64, they actually got me one. Um, another, I mean, I didn't ask for GoldenEye 007, um, but it's one of those games that I think is so phenomenal. Didn't, didn't really matter. It was so amazing, um, and that playing that game on Christmas Day um, is such a important moment for me. Um, it's one of the few games that my dad would play with me on the multiplayer. He wasn't a big console gamer. I mean, in his later years, he would play uh, PC games, but back at that time, he, you know, we rarely played games together. Um, and GoldenEye was the only one that he did. Um, and you know, I, I lost my dad ten years ago, and and it's the memories of playing GoldenEye for, for many, many years. It sticks with me as some of my favourite moments of, of spending time with him. Um, because like, you know, him and my mum were just so great and so thoughtful and always looked after me. Um, and playing GoldenEye that, all that Christmas was just uh, just one of my favourite Christmas memories. And, you know, I'm, I'm so many years later and it still sticks with me to this day. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this and want more, you can click this icon to subscribe, this icon to support me financially via Patreon, or these icons to watch more videos from my channel. Why not take a few seconds to answer the question of the week in the comments, or just let me know what you thought of this video. See you next week.